right friends, it is November 23rd right now as I'm filming this portion. I have um, just gotten started on the blanket for my niece's doll. So I'm gonna be crocheting that using a variety of scraps. Um, I will show you the yarn in just a moment and then I'll also um, share the types of yarn <laughs> like the specifications, like who made it, the weight and that kind of stuff um, down in the description below. Um, two of these are acrylic baby yarns. One of them is an opal uh, yarn. It is actually scraps from the Van Gogh collection. Um, I knit some socks with it uh, in this past year. I showed them to you guys when I knit them here for my friend's wedding. Um, so I'm using leftovers from that. Uh, and then creatures. Hey, they're trying to fight. <laughs> um, they're trying to fight. Um, and then I've got like a mysterious cotton yarn that somebody just gave me from their stash several years ago. Um, I think I've shared this before. My mom had a friend who knit a bunch of baby stuff and she downsized her stash and just gave me a whole bunch of different baby yarns. So I've got a lot of that that I just uh, throw in here and there. So yeah, those are the scraps I'm using for this scrappy granny scra stripe blanket for my niece's doll that she requested. definitely has me convinced to do magic knot for all future scrappy blankets um but I also wanted to show you I'm doing this little single crochet border along the edge um not on the starting edge just because I had the single crochet to begin with so don't feel like it really needs it um but I am doing it on the on the edges uh rest of the way around because it's just so much neater like that looks so much <laughs> messier uh, than this does. So yeah, I decided to just go ahead and do a single crochet with the gray all the way around. Um, I'm not too worried about like the ends being totally neat and everything because it's for her doll. So the four-year-old doesn't care <laughs> and it is, it's for her toy, not for her. So I think that'll be 
totally fine. I like the way the colors worked up together though. I think that's kind of nice. So this was a super quick um, like one evening project. I have got the whole thing done and now that it's daytime I thought I'd show it to you again so you could see the colors a little better. But I really like all of these yarns together. I think they're really really cute. I think the colors play nicely together. I like these little random bits of red from that opal uh, sock yarn. Yeah I think it's super cute and I hope she likes it for her little baby doll. Um, I was originally going to crochet it like this way um, longer, but then as I was crocheting it, I was like, oh, that's gonna actually be really big for a doll blanket. <laughs> so I ended up just um, making it, I guess, this way, uh, which I think is really cute. And yeah, it took like one evening of crocheting. So quick, quick gift project for the four-year-old. I think that'll be good.